Okay, so we're going to go through the steps of creating an album and sharing that album with a contact from our address book on MediaShare. So we'll start by going to the media library where we have access to all of our files in either the family library, public area, or in the private my library section. So we'll start by first of all creating the album by selecting the plus sign here on the albums area. So we give the album a name and then also a description if we so choose. And then also we have the chance to change the theme. Let's leave it as a default for now. And then also we can, if we want, share the album now or wait until later. So we're going to just create the album for now and we'll share it afterwards. So select create. And as you can see, the verbatim album has been created. So any file type can be added to this album. Photographs, documents, videos, music files, any type of file. We'll go to the family library. We're going to add some photographs in the family photos. We can select one photographs or we can hold our shift key and select multiple files and then just drag and drop those files directly into the album itself. So we're creating a virtual link to the photograph. This is not a new file. Let's go to family photos and uh, we shall add one more photograph in there. And we can go to family music and then also we've got a track here that we're going to add as well to the same album. So now we have an album with multiple files, music, and then also some photographs. The next step is to share that album. So let's select the I button on the top right area to show details. And as you can see down in the bottom here, we have the album sh sharing options once more. So we're going to share with friends. Let's select the share with friends. Now we need to at least specify one friend for sharing. All right, now we have no friends selected for sharing. So if we want to either create a contact to share or use an existing contact, we select the plus sign here. And as you can see, we have our address book with a contact already in the address book. If we want to add a new contact, select the plus for creating a contact. And here we put in the contact name and the email address. So we'll just cancel that for now and we'll use the existing contact in our address book. So let's add test to the allowed access for this album and we'll select save now as you can see test has been added to the list of uh, friends that we're going to be sharing this album with so we scroll down a little further here and we have the option to allow downloads for this album so if you would like people to be able to download those files we can uh, allow that to be uh, done so by just leaving the default selection select send invitations and an email will be sent to test at verbatim.com and in that email will be a thumbnail of each of the files but then also a link back to MediaShare and the album itself. The person will only be able to see the album in no other part of MediaShare. So we select OK. So just to make sure that that album is visible let's go to the album section in MediaShare and we can see that the album is created with the files inside there and there we go. So we've created this album, we've put some photographs and a music file there and we've also shared this album by providing an email link to a contact from our address book. Thank you.